Hi friends, do you want to access your Android files on your Windows 10 PC? Maybe you are familiar with the AirDroid and any other applications, but today I am going to show you the best ones. So what you needed, you needed the one of the most popular EX File Explorer. So open the Google Play and download it and install it. And after installation, open the EX File Explorer Manager. And then after in the in the left hand side on close to home page tap on it and in network select the option remote manager. Okay now here you need to be tap on the rectangular icon on the top and you need to be choose your tap on the set managed accounts means otherwise it's an anonymous uh, you don't we don't want to give you permission for anonymous users. So create your users whatever you want. It's a work same like at FTP, but let's see how better it is. And if you want to change the root directory, directory which by default is a uh, SD card, then if you have option to change that one. So if you want to add any directory, you can add it. As you see in here, it's a external storage and a default one is there. And then you have option to change your ports. If you don't want to change it, leave it. It's not required to changing but if you want to do it you can do it and after this what you need tap on the turn on option so basically we are going to access our Android file as a FTP uh, means Android will work as a FTP client so now on your Windows 10 PC open your browser and enter this address FTP slash and whatever address that you have you, you need to be enter it And after that, that username and password that you created, now enter it here. As you seen here, now you have all the file access, same like FTP server. Okay, you can use it and but again, maybe in your mind, this one is the, not the best one. Okay, but you are able to access that one. So how it will be the best one? Just wait. Now, open your file explorer. In file explorer, Navigate to the computer option in top. Close to view, you have computer option. Okay, in computer option, select the map network drive option. And after that, select the option connect to a, sorry, down one option connect. Now after tap on the next one, now select the option choose a different network location. Next, and then after you need to be enter the FTP address that you have for the your Android phones. You need to be enter the FTP address here and then after next and remove the option login automatically or if you want to do you can do it and now enter the username then again next and if you want to put the name you can put it click on next now click on the finish one and now enter the your FTP password your Android password that you put it for the FTP and tap on the save password if you want to automatically mount it okay as you see here now your Android files are act as now is a network drive it's a mapped in your PC so this one is the best way to access your files we are not going to be access entire Android entire, but we are going to access the entire Android files. So this one is the best way to get the all the Android files on the your Android PC. And as you see in here, it's a fully functional. You have access of each and every files of your PC, and there is nothing only and not root required anything required. It's a normal procedure. So. This one is the best way to access your Android files I'm using in my daily life. So hope you like my videos. Please subscribe. Thanks. Thanks for watching.